Hey everybody, today I want to show you a couple of projects I made today that can kind of work together for you. I've got a small simple business card holder and I also have a combination business card holder and square card reader. So let me show you how they work. First of all, here's the simple business card holder right here. And it's just a really clean and simple uh, look that you can use anywhere at any time. You can make it with all different kinds of materials. I've got uh, different slot sizes for Glowforge thick plywood. I've got them for the medium plywood. I've also got it for uh, black thick acrylic. And then I also have a version for all of these where you can add a taller back piece so that you can put a logo or a message up above if you like. So this is really simple and yet versatile and you can make it out of all different kinds of materials. Again, I've got those three materials there, but you can always adjust the slots for whatever material you like. I really like the way that this feels and looks. You can even uh, mix and match the different materials. Um, for example, you could put a clear uh, acrylic here and a clear acrylic there. That would look really nice. You could also put a acrylic, clear acrylic base underneath it to give it another uh, feel of dimension. So I really like that. But let me show you the other part that I really like. I used those exact same slots and back pieces and tabs and made a uh, combination square card reader and business card holder. So for example, this is made out of thick uh, white acrylic and also clear acrylic to go on top and the tabs and underneath. I think this looks super classy and you can just put your square card reader right there and your uh, business cards there. If you'd like to, you can engrave a message here or here. Of course, you probably know if you engrave on white, it doesn't show up really well. Uh, so just keep that in mind. You might wanna test out that a little bit. But then I've also got the same thing uh, in walnut here. And of course you steal the back piece from this one and it goes right in like that. I really like all the options that you've got here. Of course, remember always, 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 and again, I say always, measure all of your material before you start and do some test cuts before you cut anything uh, major to make sure that everything fits right. But I think you're gonna really like this particular set and it has a lot of variety and uh, options for you to use. So let me know if you have any questions, but I think you'll love it. Hit me up and I'd love to see what you create with these. Have a great day and we'll see you in the next one.